Hmm. Hello. Hello. So I found myself in the cemetery once again. This has, uh, I don't know if this will shock you or not, but this happened at least once before. I found myself in the cemetery with an easel and a canvas or two and some art supplies. Maybe listening to some music. Trying not to be too disrespectful to those interned there. And I'm not there for any dismal, depressing, gloomy reasons. It's just, if you find a nice cemetery like this, it can be a pretty nice place. There's not a, not a lot of people. The landscaping is pleasing to the eye. And there's, there's little kind of bite-sized chunks of architecture everywhere. Whether it's just the different tombstones or... Uh, in a place like this one, it's kind of a fancy cemetery, the one I'm at in this video, where a lot of people, I don't know why, but they like setting up actual like mausoleums and huge statues over, I don't know, there's like family plots and stuff set up. It's, it's very interesting to look at. And you can walk around and you can kind of start daydreaming about what these people were about just by, the, you know, there's little snippets on people's. Um, tombstones and stuff. It's not, it's not too depressing, I don't think. Especially if you're there on a nice day with a little breeze and, and then the the sun is shining and there's lots of at least in this one there's lots of like little flowers and bushes and stuff growing all around in it. It's, it's very peaceful to me and it's a, for me it's a good, if I'm gonna go paint outside and do art outside, this is like my, this is the type of park that I'd like to go to. If I go to a park, usually you're always surrounded by everyone like running around. There's kids screaming everywhere. There's the, the park nearest to my house is a, there's a dog park. So there's dogs barking and joggers running by all the time, huffing and puffing. And I just, it's just not my ideal park situation. And going to the cemetery is much closer to what I want from a park. But I do a little bit uh, regret saying all this because then I feel like everyone's going to start going to cemeteries and it'll be super popular and, and next time I go there, it might be really crowded with people you know, putting out quilts and blankets and stuff. Because it actually says on their website that it's, it's totally open and public and everyone can go there with you know, kids and pets and you can even have picnics there, it says. Uh, which I guess is nice. That's a nice thing. It, uh, anyways, I, I, I just, this is what I'm doing with the, I just had some acrylic paints. For some reason, it's very satisfying to me to just get a palette knife and a canvas. It, for, I think for the palette knife, maybe even canvas board is more satisfying since it doesn't, uh, if you just use like a regular uh, framed canvas, it kind of gives way under the palette knife a little bit, but this, they're, they're both good for different reasons, but I just like scraping it around, squishing it around. Sometimes it turns out in a way that I really enjoy, and sometimes not quite so much, but I like the, the feeling and the action of squishing the paint around regardless. And like I said, it was a nice day, so I, 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 don't, I don't feel like I wasted my time at all. I don't. And, and the thing is kind of, I think it, the actual finished painting is kind of interesting to look at. Anyways, this was one where it kind of, I had one envisioning idea. I'm not going to tell you what I think it looks like, but I had one idea for it for almost the whole time. It, it, one thing at the beginning, and then for like the middle 80%, I had one kind of idea in my head. And then like right near the end, it switched a tiny bit again. But all of these ideas I had were very vague, kind of amorphous and misty. But I just kept squishing and... Uh, I think the more I do it, the more I'll like the end result, but I still like the actual physical process of it, even when I don't like the end result sometimes. So, I mean, I'd recommend getting some, getting a little canvas panel and acrylic paints and a little knife and squishing stuff around if you want. It's fun. Do it up. All right. Goodbye, everybody. Hope you have a good day.